Yeah, yeah. What up, Money Plays? Hey, I just want everybody to put their hands together if you got roaches. Come on now, I know, I know y'all got roaches out here in Vegas. Because uh, I just recently found out that I have roaches. I figured for the type of money that we pay where we stay at up in Summerlin, we wouldn't have such critters. But uh, yeah, they come out disrespectful and shit. Walking all up on the counter, get right up on your bread. You be like, damn. Like you be sitting in the bathroom and shit on that toilet. And that roach come out, you in the middle of Candy Crush and shit. Then that roach come out, you got your pants, you're like, oh shit, you're trying to step on it, but your pants leg won't let your leg go that far. <laughs> then on some other sick shit, you run out of tissue, ain't nobody at the crib. So you gotta do that walk to the, get the pantry to get the tissue. Yeah, I know that's that real shit, I speak that real shit, man. That's stuff that everybody go through. Like if you live in Vegas, they got rude ass drivers out here. And it's mainly the old people. They rude as hell. Can't see for shit, but they mad at you for you making a real turn right in front of them and shit. It's crazy. Metro, dangerous. Is there any metro in this motherfucker? Because you motherfuckers are sneaky. Like, they be having them traps sitting in the bushes and shit. You fuck around and just stop and go past the stop sign. That motherfucker done pulled you over on Lake Mead and Town Center Drive, smoke all in the car, you're like, shit, I'm going to jail. Come to find out, he a pothead, so he let you go. He just took some weed from you. Man, I've been out here in Vegas just chilling. I was here last week on some other shit. You know, uh, I'm from uh, Gary, Indiana. Well, that's what I'm talking about, right there. Midwest, Chi-Town shit. Chief Keith, no. Um, y'all like that shit? No Chief Keef? That motherfucker don't speak no English. You notice how in all his videos, they be showing like Chicago smoking lots of blunts, big blunts. Man, they sell you such small ass sacks. And they take them and they be like, man, my dude got four for five. And you be like, no, he just got all, he just got your whole blunt chopped up in point twos. That's what he just did to you. He made it seem like it was a deal, but that shit wasn't no deal. He's still selling you the same damn blunt for $5, motherfucker. Chizzy-ass sack. They got like 30 blunts in the video, all paper. Guaranteed they roll each sack. I'm a hood comic. I speak some hood stuff. Some of y'all might not laugh, because I'm from a real hood, but we got sheets in the windows. Fuck a curtain, Transformers. SpongeBob, you know what I'm saying? We messed up, messed up. Gary, shitty. I love it, I love my city, but we do shitty shit. Like, famous people don't come to our city because we rob them. And then we brag about it, like we took Gucci Man's chain. I mean, I don't know if that's real or not, don't quote me, but I mean, shit like that happened and Rappers act like they the shit, like they tough as fuck, but when you catch them by they self, they do get robbed. I really do believe TMZ catches everybody. You know TMZ is there. They probably in this motherfucker. All of us will be on TV tonight. TMZ catches everybody. I know y'all know about Donald Sterling. You heard about his shit. Boo, fuck him. Shit. He might fuck around and run for president. We got the kind of country we we'll elect any motherfucker. Like when they, I mean, who voted for Obama? Nobody in this motherfucker voted for Obama. He gets no love in this bar, huh? Fuck him. Okay, we got one motherfucker that voted for Obama. Is he doing it though? I mean, we got a lot of shit happening, man. We fighting all, you know, they want us to fight all these different people. I mean, I love every race, but. There's a lot of Chinese motherfuckers, you know what I'm saying? We go off fighting like Chinese people. They, they you know, they gonna stick up for they shit. Cause it's, it's a lot of them. They got countries full, just ready. That's why we can't kill them Taliban people. It's a lot of them, they die for they shit. We don't have people in America that really will die like the Taliban die. 
I think about these gangsters, you know what I'm saying? They be like, yeah, I'm out in the battlefield killing people, doing this. I'm doing, ooh, we bang, bang. We should, like, bring our troops home and put them motherfuckers to war. I mean, they say they can do it. They kill all these people. They got the teardrops and shit like they've been crying forever. They got that shit. So let's test it. Let's put them out there. Fuck a vest, you know what I'm saying? Do what you do. That's what I say. I mean, don't let me be president. It'll be fucked up. I will legalize marijuana, though. I'm high right now. But I'm a cool ass high, though, you know what I'm saying? Who smoked them trees? I know it's way more motherfuckers in here that smoke marijuana, though. We in Sin City, home of drugs. You can buy a crack at 3.45 in the morning. This is where we're at. I remember when I first came to Vegas, I stayed on like the hilltops on like Bonanza and 15th. That's right, dawg. We gangster, baby. You know what I'm saying? Hey, they was doing it over there. Them crackheads was running the block. Them motherfuckers was up 2, 3 in the morning painting the motherfucking government building. Fuck it. We high. <laughs> Just <laughs> fucked up, dude. Shit, I'm fat. Hey, <laughs> give it up for all the fat people. Fat people raise your hand when you put your shirt on and you raise your hand, your fucking shirt rise up, it's too small. Don't come outside with that small shit on because I will stop and laugh. I will. I'm fat, but I will laugh at another fat motherfucker because I don't understand how the fuck you get that fat. Like, they be had that 600 pound life. How the fuck you get 600? Like, at two or three, I would have been like, damn, my knees are too big. Like, I can't see shit no more. I need to lose weight. Only bad thing about me being fat, it's hard to roll weed and shit. Because when I be like sitting down and shit, you know what I'm saying? Fat people know your stomach, you know, your lap go away. You just got knees and shit. So when I be trying to roll the weed and shit, I be like trying to roll it. And then when I breathe and shit, it push the tray off my knee and shit. I got weed all on my front seat. <laughs> Fucked up. It's bad. These lights, just like last week, they hot to the motherfucker. Mike told me don't do no racist joke. I, yeah, I know, man. Fuck it, you know what I'm saying? I did one last week, though, man. He didn't, I don't know, man. I thought it was cool. Y'all want to hear that shit? Go ahead. Tell, I tell it again. Fuck it, I'm going to tell it again. And then I'm going to tell another racist joke right behind that motherfucker. Hold on, I'm sagging. Let me put my pants up. My pants see my ass. All right. Uh, black women, this is, I didn't mean this, nothing mean there's any here, I didn't mean it. It was just some high shit, you know what I'm saying? I just came up with it, but how does a black woman know that she pregnant? Because when she pulled the tampon out, the cotton already picked. That's a low blow, I know. For all the people that get it later on in life, you know what I'm saying? They're going to be like, shit, that motherfucker was wrong. I'm going to let you know, when you see me in the streets of Vegas, it's okay to come up to me and talk to me because I'm a cool person. You know what I mean? I'll talk to you. I'll take a picture with you. I don't know what I'll do in the picture, but I mean, I'll take it with you. You know what I'm saying? If you see me smoking, hey, I'll blow a blunt with you. I'm cool like that. No police, right? Because I don't want them to hear that shit. I'll be getting high to the motherfucker. But no, uh, you know, about President Obama, though, you know, once he does get out of office, though, we're going to have to build another White House. And the reason for that is because you know how hard it is to get a nigga out of government housing. <laughs> You'll get that later on when you visit your friends. Yo, I'm about to go, because you know what? The shit's getting... I'm getting hungry, though. I ain't gonna lie to you, but I'm about to go. <laughs> Comedian Doughboy Tyler, y'all be safe. Do y'all thing. I'm out. <laughs>